best use case for blockchains that I see. Uh, down the line, if latency and data and things are um, not as big of um, barriers, then I could also see a decentralized AI being built with a uh, blockchain backend, um, similar to, yeah, I, I could I could see that kind of thing where like the a, the LLM is being trained through you know many different participants and uh, where the data is uh, somehow verified or hosted through zk proofs to to compress the data size or something like that. Um, I could see that also maybe a third use an intersection between AI and crypto. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. Very nice. Thank you for sharing. I see. Um, the the doomers, the AI doomers part really got me emotional um, because I believe in scale technocracy where uh, people can choose how much they want to be engaged in technocratic narratives and in the singularity eventually. Uh, so uh, I want to create um, opportunities uh, for people who do not want to potentially use any of these technologies at all. And um, that's quite a very big spectrum to look at, right? But myself, I, I, when I have a child, I don't want to register it anywhere. So how do I go about How can I create an infrastructure for myself so that I can do that, actually? You know, or have my own country, uh, right? Um, so these are kind of ambitions that I'm looking at right now with specifically conversations that I have with people that I invite here. Um, we got to be ambitious uh, in order to accomplish big things. I believe. And um, the last question I will ask to you, which is going to be in about 20 minutes, but I want to prepare you for that, is uh, where do you see yourself in 2034? Um, 